So I want to talk to you about a magic trick that you can do with your money, right? So I met with a client. She's also a staff member of mine, her and her husband. Uh, They have a newborn. He's six months old. Okay, six months new, I guess. And we were able to put together a sacred account, his own banking system. What's up, Aaron? Good to see you. So check this out. This guy is six months old and he already has his own banking system at six months old, right? So what does that mean? It means that we put together uh, something called the infinite banking concept. We use properly structured, high early cash value, dividend paying whole life insurance. I know that's a super long name, so I just call it the sacred account, but we put together a sacred account for him and they're putting in about a thousand dollars a year into this policy, okay? Really quick thing, just so you know how this works, you put money in, just like with your own bank, you deposit money in, but it's not someone else's bank now, it's your own bank, you're using life insurance and being your own bank. Usually when you deposit money into someone else's bank, the banker borrows against your deposits and loans those out to other people. So while they're paying you 0.40%, they're charging someone else 4% on a mortgage and they're keeping what's called the spread, the difference between what they're making in interest and what they're paying you. Now they keep that spread, it turns into profit, they pay that profit to their shareholders, right? And then they take that profit and they took they take the, the, the reserves, they put that into life insurance policies. It's called bank owned life insurance policies. So all of this stuff already happens with your money. So with this guy, Dante, six months old, we set up his own sacred account. His mom did, right? His mom and his dad. And so we basically are, they're putting $1,000 a year into it, depositing, and it's going to grow at about a three to 5% tax-free return for the rest of Dante's life. Now, here's the kicker. When you borrow against this money, right? Because the bank already borrows against your money. So when you put money in your sacred account, you're also going to borrow against it. When you borrow against it, you're still getting that three to 5% while you use your money. Okay, so Dante is putting $1,000 a year into this thing. And so I was looking at the numbers with his parents and I was like, look, he's gonna keep funding his own banking system. And when he's in his older years and he's ready to withdraw money for retirement or for whatever, he'll be able to borrow against his, his cash, his deposits, use those. And while he's using them, they will still grow like they never left. And while they're doing that from one year to the next, He's going to have enough in interest and dividends he's earning that he'll put his thousand dollars in that year. He already took the entire cash out. He pulled all the money out and then he puts a thousand dollars in the next year because that's his annual contribution. He'll put a thousand dollars in and he'll have 90,000 new dollars available, even though his money is gone. Like, just think about what I just said there. This should blow your mind. Imagine setting up a checking account where you put money in, you grow it and it's, you know, performing and you pull all of it out. And even though you pulled all of it out, the bank still paid you interest like it never left, even though it did leave. And you deposit your $1,000 next year again, but instead of having $1,000, you've got $90,000. That should blow your mind. So guys, Dante is six months old. Six months old. Dante is going to be able to buy real estate in in his late teens. He's going to be able to fund his own college if he chooses to go to college. He's gonna be able to buy his house, doing all of this through his own banking system. He will never have a mortgage. He will never have a car loan. He will never have to worry about paying interest to someone else's bank. Every single thing you guys would do with a bank, Dante is going to be able to do with his own banking system and make and keep all of that money himself, right? So if you're watching this, it's Father's Day coming up, right? If you're a father, you've got kids. If you're a mother, you've got kids. It is so important that you start your kids on a system like this early. The reason why Dante can put in $1 and have 90 available, he puts in a thousand and he has 90,000 new dollars available that same year is because he started his banking system, his sacred account when he was young. I personally am 31. I'm I'm setting up uh, my fourth and fifth ones right now, my fourth fourth and fifth sacred accounts, right? And so uh, I'm setting up my fourth and fifth ones right now. And I'm never going to see an illustration that good. My numbers will never be. I put in a dollar and pull out 90 because even at 31, I'm not going to get the same numbers Dante does. A six month old. I've got another client. His name is Tim. We've got a policy set up for each of his four children. I've got another client named Justin. He's got seven kids. We're going to set up policies for each and every one of them. Right? So this is something that if you have children start now a thousand dollars a year. That's how much Dante is doing. That's like $80, $90 a month. You waste that on coffee and Netflix, right? So set your kids up. And the beautiful thing about this is while it's growing, Dante's parents can use this policy. 
they can borrow against it. They can use it to improve the family's financial condition. Does Dante not benefit from that? So this is not a college fund that you can't touch till he goes to his university. What if he never goes? This is not a retirement account that he can't use till 59 and a half. This is something that right away his parents can start borrowing against those deposits, using those to improve the family, and then Dante will still get the future value of all of that money in his later years, even while his family uses it today. Guys, I'm gonna post a quick link if you're here in the chat right now um, watching this with me today. So if you go to my store, and that's gonna be store.jerryfetta.com, I'm gonna give you 50% off of everything in the store for Father's Day, store.jerryfetta.com. Okay, you've gotta use coupon code, who is your daddy, right? And the reason why we're using that coupon code, not only is it hilarious, right? But for most people, their sugar daddy is the bank, Wall Street, and the IRS. You make money and you give it all to them first. That's your sugar daddy, right? Instead, I want you to actually pay yourself first. And the only way you can do that is by owning the bank. And the only way you can own the bank is by becoming your own banker and setting up a sacred account. So instead of me giving the money to Wall Street where they're gonna have it till I'm 60 and generate fees off of it or giving it to the bank where they're gonna borrow against my deposits, loan them out to other people, make 400 to 1300% on my money each year it's left there. You can go check that stat. That's really what happens. And pay me 0.40% for risking my money or giving it to the IRS interest-free on an overpayment on my monthly tax withdrawal so they can give me a refund at the end of the year and I can celebrate that they stole my money. Instead of doing that, set up your sacred account. Pay yourself first. Become your own banker, but truly pay it into your own banking system. That's all I got for you guys today. Check out store.jerryfetta.com. Again, coupon code, who is your daddy? Have a great weekend. I'll talk to you next time.